On Monday, British officials denied the rumors that King Charles III had died, which were widely reported by numerous media outlets earlier in the day. As numerous Russian news sources reported the passing of the UK ruler, the English consulate in Ukraine gave a reaction saying that the report about the demise of Lord Charles III is phony. Welcome viewers to my channel, please subscribe, like my video and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next update. To be explicit, King Charles is being treated for malignant growth, Buckingham Royal Residence had reported in February. The news followed days after the 75-year-old ruler went through a medical procedure for an developed prostate in January end. Outstandingly, another imperial relative Catherine or Kate Middleton, the Princess of Wales, likewise went through a stomach a medical procedure in January, yet has not shown up since. This set off a worldwide consideration around her well-being and the occasions occurring at the imperial home. The bits of gossip encompassing the Lord's demise have all the earmarks of being an augmentation of the continuous PR emergency. Fans and pundits have concocted various fear-inspired notions about the imperial family, going from ruler of ribs, William's supposed issue to Kate being under, instigated trance state, among others. The regal family's quietness regarding this situation, combined with the course of press articles, has had such an impact that notwithstanding the authority word from UK authorities, numerous web clients seem, by all accounts, to be unconvinced that the UK king is for sure alive. Kate's altered picture raises PR emergency. The absence of trust among individuals seems to have originated from the Walk 10 occasion, the UK Mother's Day festivity, when the castle imparted a picture of Kate to her three youngsters, which later ended up being altered. Numerous news organizations, including the Associated Press, confirmed this. With the occurrence, Kate fans are concerned assuming Buckingham Royal Residence's reports on Kate's post-recuperation circumstance can be relied upon by any stretch of the imagination. The 75-year-old ruler was spotted on Tuesday leaving Windsor Palace and showing up at Clarence House, hours prior to facilitating a group of people with veterans at Buckingham Castle to check the 70th commemoration of the Korean conflict. While ruler Charles met with some Korean conflict veterans, Princess Anne and Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, later facilitated a different gathering Tuesday for many veterans for his sake, which he didn't join in. Anne, Princess Regal, conveyed her siblings' discourse for him. It has been an individual desire of mine to welcome all of you, in some structure, to Buckingham Castle to perceive this huge achievement and guarantee you are most deservingly respected for your courageous help a while back, the Lord's discourse said. Anne likewise communicated Charles's mistake that he was unable to go to face to face. Lord Charles is as yet getting therapy for an undisclosed sort of malignant growth, news he unveiled in February. The ruler has decreased his obligations and scaled back open appearances while he recuperates. Working royals inside the family are set to help the Lord with a portion of his authority obligations during this time. Ruler Charles's appearances come a day after the English government and its Moscow and Kiev international safe havens needed to proclaim that the ruler was alive in the midst of bogus gossipy tidbits about his demise spread by Russian media. On Monday, Russian state media and a few web-based entertainment accounts referred to obscure sources in their accounts guaranteeing that ruler Charles had kicked the bucket. The misleading cases spread to the media in Ukraine and Tajikistan. After the Princess of Wales withdrew from the public eye following a planned abdominal surgery, in January, conspiracy theories have been circulating regarding the health of Kate Middleton, her whereabouts, and her upcoming marriage to Prince William. This has led to a flurry of broader speculation and misinformation regarding